What's up, YouTube? We're back with the Battle Bunch. So I came and got me something to eat. And I am about to get my food. Good, how are you? And so we got some orange juice here. 20 pieces of eight. Yeah. And I am going to go home and go eat. So I just wanted to give y'all an update. I have my twin girls at home. It has been a true blessing to have them both at home finally because, well, the day that I was supposed to bring one home, the other one got admitted to the hospital for RSV. I officially hate winter time. Um, well, I'm with the girls being creamy, I think it took an extra toll on her, and I was scared to death, y'all. I um, took her to the hospital. It was like two something. When I told my husband, I said, "Well, I'm just gonna be cautious." I said, "I don't like the way she looks. I'm going to the hospital." So we get there, and they took us into triage, and she told me to put her on the scale, and. I leaned her forward, you know, holding her. And I told that lady, I said, I don't like the way she looks. She said, may either run. So we ran down the hallway. Yes, my fat ass ran. And her eye skin was low. She was turning blue all through here. And so, I was like, oh, we'll keep her for a couple of days, you know, to watch her. Then they took a swab in her nose. She's got RSV. So, we end up being there for 13 days. But, of course, I didn't mind because I just wanted her to healthy. And with them being preemie, it took a lot out of her. But now, she's being a precious little girl with this North Carolina going through menopause and this weather. You know, it's kind of hard. Like, the last week or so, it's been like 80 degrees in our house because, you know, it really hasn't been that cold. And we're like, oh my God, it's hot. But, you know, we don't want them to get sick. So, you know, we're being cautious with, you know, the air and stuff. And, um, but like I said, I just wanted to give y'all an update and... I will probably do another video later just so you can see the beautiful girls and the rest of the gang because let me tell you these boys has been wide open they also have holds because you know it's hard to tell them to and understand you don't touch the babies and they want the wipe snot and so me and my husband's basically like every two minutes sanitizing disinfecting the house it seems like in between feeding and changing all the kids and but it's a part of parenthood and so like i said i just wanted to give y'all a quick update and let you know we're all doing great and we will get back with you guys later and make sure you like share and subscribe and we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.